Good evening, everybody. This is Ntabeleng from Gateway News. And today we are launching the youth wing of Gateway News. Yay! So for those of you who may not know what Gateway News is and what it is all about, this is a news media company that publishes the Philippians for eight kind of news. We are deliberate that we want to publish the news that inspiring hope in Christ that reflect the heart of, of God for this generation and anything that's inspirational instead of something that will cause dejection and stuff. Because we know how much news have influence and impact on our thoughts, on our emotions, as well as our behaviors at times. So today we are going to start by sharing the story of the youth ministry called Rich for Life. Rich for Life started in Soweto by the gentleman called Sefiso Sitebe. He is a professional educator. He is the preacher of the word. He is very passionate about impacting the youth for Christ and he's also a soccer player. So he started this thing that when before or after their practices they would have sessions to just preach the gospel to share the word and then to pray together and let's hear from him i'm telling you we saw amazing things happening there and uh, when we started those programs we began to see god changing the character uh, of my brothers that I was playing with, uh, God began to change their behaviors. The, the coach had less stress because now the way of God was, was keeping uh, the brothers grounded in terms of their lifestyle and, and how they behaved towards, towards the coach and the leadership of the team. Then we began to see the Lord there bringing total transformation. And from there we began to see the Lord and lifting up some of the players because we had some of the players that went to play for professional teams. Some of his of testimonies have actually been reported from this ministry. The behaviors have been changed, the addictions have been broken, the livelihoods have been improved, and the hope has been revived in most of the young people who play soccer. People have started dreaming again, people have started pursuing education and, and stuff like that. So uh, this is this is a powerful ministry. Of note is the the, the personal testimony of one of the players called Sibusiso Ralefala. Sibusiso reports that he was in, involved in dangerous risky behavior from a tender age. He was just somebody who was just doing a whole lot of um, funny stuff. But then as Craze would have it, towards the end, towards the time when he would be writing his metric in 2020, that is when he started joining Rich for Life movement through the soccer team that he joined. And he reports that gradually his behavior started changing. He reports that he had anger issues and somehow he started seeing his heart being softened and then and, and stuff like that he would relate better with people and his behavior generally things started changing on his behalf all to the glory of god now unfortunately because he had not applied for universities on time he was not admitted to any university to study in 2021. But again, by the grace of God, he got a retail learnership that he was busy doing throughout 2021. And this time he applied on time and got admitted to two universities, actually, Northwest University and University of Johannesburg. So he chose to go study in the Northwest University where he is currently and he's just enjoying life loving god and doing all he can to impact the people around him for christ as well wow isn't this amazing who would have thought to just start, like through soccer and uh, lives could be transformed and we hear that some people were signed up by the professional teams now they are earning good income from that and they have made a career that is amazing and we truly thank god for that
We would also like to hear your story. Should there be anything, your testimony, or something that you know about somebody, or even yourself, or the work that you are doing for Christ, and that's worth sharing in this platform, we would love to hear from you, and then to publish the wonderful things that God is doing all throughout. Thank you for watching our first broadcast of the Youth Wing. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe like the video and we would like to hear from you so please leave the comments in the comment section below and then see you again next time bye bye